Hey there, welcome to this training. Uh, I've had to do this as a recording uh, because uh, it's not letting me zoom into uh, Facebook, okay? So this training that we're actually going to talk about, I'm going to share with you the technique that I used and give you the actual visualization of how I was able to manifest over 8,000 worth of sales while laid up in my bed sick, okay? So I was sick for about two weeks, could hardly move, uh, really couldn't do very much. Uh, but I used this technique and paired that with affiliate marketing, but you could use this if you've got your own program. Um, and I paired that so that, yeah, even while I uh, wasn't very well, couldn't work like you would normally work, I was able to actually manifest sales. Okay, so before I share that technique with you, what am I going to say to you? Uh, please, I would love, love, love to hear from you. So make sure that you comment and you say hello in the box below, okay? And tell us where in the world you are actually watching from, okay? And if, if you are watching this over on YouTube, what I want you to do is whack on that subscribe button as well, okay? So down in the corner, I think it's that side, uh, <laughs> whacking the button, whichever side it is actually on, subscribe, and yes, as well, you know, say hello in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. Okay, right, so let's get going with this, okay? We're, we're going to make this a, a wee bit shorter than normal. So what had happened, um, I, I've actually got like a, a health condition that I was healing. And at that point, you know, like it really, really spiked up. Whatever had been going on, I could hardly move. Now I was a coach and a consultant. And when you're sick or, you know, like I was sick at that time, um, I couldn't sell my own programs, okay? So I couldn't take on any more clients myself. I couldn't get on um, to do sales calls either, you know? So I really, I just wasn't well at all. And I thought to myself, what can I actually do here? Um, and this was one of the things that had come to me. So, you know, with anything with business, um, I never ever just have business or marketing, I always blend energy mastery with that and us using our creative power to actually manifest the results that we want uh, because that, that's where it really comes from. Um, any strategies or systems or things like that don't work for you um, if you have, you know, if your energy is completely way off, your focus is off and uh, your focus is on more of what you don't like instead of what you actually do want to create okay so that that's it you know basically so here I was in this situation um I you know could hardly move and uh, then it suddenly came to me well you know what I can share um another you know coaches package um I could absolutely share that and there's there's two parts to this really there is the creation part and I'm going to give that to you here but what you'll want to do is um, I do talk more about sharing another person's um, like products, services, packages to earn a high income uh, from your your social media page or whatever it is that you are marketing. Uh, I do share that and I'll be sharing that in another video, in fact. OK, so you want to make sure that you're in my group and the training will take place there or have a little look on my uh YouTube page also because there'll be times when I'll be putting some training up on there too. Right, okay, so um, yeah, so I decided that I was going to share, uh, just share, you know, this, this other person's package, okay? So I had chosen a result. Um, so that, that's one of your first steps. It's always your first step. Uh, it doesn't need to be, you know, like the big grand goal. Uh, so most of the time people are like, they, they want the big grand goal. But um, there was a specific result that I wanted to start seeing in my business. Now, I was laid up in bed, right? So um, it wasn't so much that it was like a push 
for this to happen right now. Uh, it was just a case of, right, okay, well, th these are the results that I want to see. And what it really was, was the payments coming through. Um, and, you know, actually the, the, the sales just happening. Um, so that, that was one of the things that I wanted to see. Now, it, it doesn't mean to say that you don't take action, but we'll go into that after. Right, so that was one of the results. And I'm going to show you um, one of the images because I used an example of this image, okay? And you can have this as well. Um, let me just, there we go, screen share. Right, okay, so this this kind of example here, right? So I, I what I actually had was I had somebody else's proof shot at first okay and i used that person's proof shot as a kind of focal point for me so it's like an actual image uh because that that was the result that i wanted to see i wanted to see my my own results coming through um just you know like pretty much like this okay so i i had that as a visual that was my choice. I wanted to see payments coming through my bank account just like that, okay? This ended up being one of my um, my very own proof shots. And I share this for others to be able to use the same technique that I had used, you know, myself as well, okay? So now I'm able to take my own proof shots and give that to others so that they can do the same. You know, they, they, they've got a focal point. They're able to say, right, okay, yes, this is mine. And, you know, you, you just visualize that being your results, okay? And I'll pop that, um, I'll pop the link so that you'll be able to get a copy of this uh, just below this video or um, above the video in the description area, okay? So that was the first thing. So I'd chosen, I wanted to see sales coming in my business anyway. I didn't know fully how I was going to make this all happen because I um, was laid up sick and big. But I'd made the choice. That's what I wanted to see. Um, so th that that was it for me, okay? So that, that was one of the first steps, making that choice. Then I had this, this focal point that um, I could go in and really visualize this, right? I'm just do the stop, stop here. Okay, so that's your first step, right? So your first step is to choose, obviously, you know, the, the kind of results that you're wanting to have in your business. And that, that could be in a month or it could be as fast as possible, um, you know, so you you choose for you, right? As fast as possible. Uh, that's that's simply what I want to see. I want to see those payments coming through, and you know, you you feel all of that. So the choice is there. And then I had a visual. Um, now you don't need a visual, okay? If you've got a great imagination as well, you can simply imagine however that looks for you, the result that you're wanting, how that works for you, okay? But I had that visual as well that I could just look at every now and again, and then I would see it in my mind also now the next step that i used um i'm going to give you there's there's two two parts to this as well because i want to tell you um a really really special lesson that i'd actually learned um on this journey because i was a person that uh, i was a single mother with a very very large family no family around me for support um, so a lot of the time we look at the outside and we let that dictate to us how we're going to behave and act and what we can do, right? So that that one of the things that I'm going to be sharing with you is how to stop doing that because this is what sabotages so many people. They're always looking outside, they're listening to whatever's going on outside, what it's saying on bank balances or whatever else. And they're allowing that to dictate the results that they're going to get, right? So I'm going to share with you a little technique as well, an added extra technique to stop doing that, right? But the next step that I used, I have actually got a visualization that I had created. Um, and I had created this through, a, you know, various studies. Um, one, I was working closely with Bob Proctor as well. So I had created this visualization for people um, and there's a lot of energy that is inside this as well, uh, specifically to support you in 
uh, overcoming those blocks. I don't like to say to release them because one of the biggest things I'm going to say to you that had come to me uh, is that the only reason we are blocked is because we believe we are blocked. <laughs> Okay, so wrap your head around that one. Um, so I don't like to say I'm going to remove your blocks or things like that, but for you to be able to create, even if the, you know, the, the crappy stuff is there, the crappy beliefs or things like that, you can actually create what you want, even if they are there. You don't need to get rid of them, okay? So that is what is uh, built into also this visualization exercise, okay? So it helps you to shift your focus into what you do want. Uh, and I've got a wee touch of magic going on inside that visualization. So I listen to that and I actually listen to it more uh, because again, I was laid up sick in bed, couldn't really do much. So I thought to myself, well, hey, you know, people have created miracles. Um, you know, people have healed things that they were told were unhealable simply with the power of their mind and visualization, um, you know, whilst they've been laid up in bed. So I, you know, I adopted that and um, I actually just visualized more because, hey, you're lying in bed anyway. Um, so I, I visualized my results and I just did that a little bit more, okay, because I couldn't do a lot of the action, action, action type thing, right? And then, obviously, I'd taken, you know, like what one of uh, the, the coaches, there was actually two coaches, so there's two products that I was sharing as well. So one of them was one week and the next week it was an, another one that I was sharing. So I had two coaches' products. Um, that I knew of, that, you know, I, I loved, and I was sharing that, okay, so I, I simply, it was just a link, um, and that's what affiliate marketing is, <laughs> you know, you get to share somebody else's work and things like that, and you get a commission from it, and it was a higher commission, right, we're not talking about £10 or, you know, the, the lower end commissions, um, it was actually the higher end commissions, okay, so I took that, and I was like, right, okay, so I vision, you know, chose the result that I wanted to have. I uh, just simply used that track and I was visualizing more. Um, I chose, you know, like a product that I was going to share. And the way that I did this, now I already at least had some of the foundations built out um, for me to be able to share that link with others, simply lying in my bed, <laughs> you know, just from my phone, you know, because you've got your phone in your hand anyway. And most of the time we, we do pretty much, you know, scroll through um, and comment and uh, connect with people. And that that was really, that was, you know, all that I did. It was, you know, I was kind of like a middleman, so to speak. I was still able to inspire people, connect with people um, from my Facebook page and then just, you know, guiding them to the solution to a problem that they have got. Okay, so that in there, and again, we're, we can talk more about that um, afterwards. So that, that was one of the things I did with this technique. So there was action involved. There was some action, but as you're aware, it wasn't like a lot of action, okay? Now, the next step in this, so I'm going to pop that visualization again. The link for the visualization is either above or below in the description area, okay? So make sure that you get that. Now, the next section is what sabotages people and a little trick, a little technique to overcome that, okay? And this is something that you're all going to want to hear about. So what I would love for you is, you know, so far, your comment below, what is it so far that has stood out for you during this video? And again, if you haven't done so, give this button some love, give the button some love, give this video some love, okay? Whack on that love button or either whack on the subscribe button, which whichever side it is actually on. So hit on that subscribe button as well, okay? Right, so let's get to it. Let's get down, let's get down to business. Uh, if when you join my group, you'll know that we, we love to get a wee bit corny and to dance. Right, okay, next part. 
how to stop sabotaging yourself. So what happens, I'm not going into a full thing about beliefs and programs and everything like that in here, okay? But put it in simple terms, we allow the outside world, um, what is around us, situations that are around us, people that are around us, that hits on our senses, that causes you to think thoughts. And then when you start to also get emotional about those thoughts that you're thinking, it's sinks into your subconscious mind. It makes you move into the wrong actions. It makes you think that you're not capable, you can't do this, yada, 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 all of that, that kind of stuff, right? So it's basically, you start making up stories of why you can't make sales or you can't do this um, thing that you want to do because of X, Y, Z. And it's all boom. It is all bull okay you have got power beyond beyond what you can see and that's what I want you to know and we all need that reminder now and again okay especially nowadays we've really you've, you've got to get yourself surrounded more than ever by people on that path okay because it's about coming back into the center and remembering you do have the power here to create so when your senses are getting hit and you're feeling that uh, discord, you're feeling uneasy, you're feeling like you're doubting yourself and doubting your abilities and your power to actually do this, one technique that really, really helped me in that moment is I will have, you know, like one or two videos, two main ones that I can simply grab onto that. So in that moment when... The, I call it the shadow rises. Um, you, you've got all of the, the feelings telling you you can't do something and to back off. In that moment, I will take one of those videos and I will watch them. And it plugs me back into my truth. You know, it will remind you of your power. Okay, this is why you know, Bob Proctor actually does uh, repetition with study, you know, so he doesn't speed read books, it's like repetition, sometimes one chapter, and he did one chapter for a whole year, and this is why, okay, so in short terms here, you know, it's like having a couple of powerful videos that remind you, hey, hang on a second, you know, what, what you're seeing on the outside of you isn't your truth right and it's just something that will remind you of your power in those moments okay so i mean back then i mean i've learned so much more about alchemy and um creative power and i'm always learning always learning we never know it all um and i certainly don't know it all and i'm always learning but back then that was all that i used back then um, and I was able to create results, okay? And then it's about consistency because when you receive those results, when you apply what I'm giving you here and you receive those results, normally your self-sabotage patterns start to come in and start to drag you down again, okay? And you want to be aware of those self-sabotaging patterns, right? So that's absolutely something to be, you know, it's about consistency. When you get those results coming through, then it's like you've really got to be aware of this. And then you don't let those same patterns when dragging you back to the old and instead you crash through to the other sides. OK, so that's that. So let's just do a little bit of a recap of what you are going to do um, with this. You're going to choose a result desired okay one that you would just love to have for you okay you're not blocked you're not broken you know right so even though I was laid up in bed <laughs> um okay you're just simply choosing a result don't get so hung up on it. it doesn't mean anything if you don't you know get that result you choose the result desired for you then you're going to use your visualization now when you visualize you're connecting to the power of love you know, you're like that result desired. It's not just about seeing money coming through. Now, if you're looking for sales um, and you'll hear this in the visualization, it's not just about seeing sales signs. So in that visualization, I actually take you in to see specific things beyond just the money coming in. OK, but it takes you doing this like not just once or twice or for a couple of days. 
right? It takes you doing this consistently. And sometimes a few days, it's 10 minutes long. It's only 10 minutes. 10 minutes for you to pop into your results desired, okay? For you to draw that into this physical reality, right? So you're going to listen to that visualization a few times over. When you start to doubt yourself and you get the, the shadows coming up, I want you to think to yourself of a couple of videos or a couple of lessons that when you watch it, it reminds you, you have ultimate power within you. Right, because those doubts will come up when you choose a goal. Your all your shit will come up, right? It will surface up. It's it's just the way things are. So instead of seeing it as a bad thing, know what it is. It's not your truth. It's actually from shadow. And again, we we'll go into that more, right? But know that it's not your truth. And instead, it's like just have something that will bring you back into your power, and then you're going to focus on that result desired anyway. You're gonna focus on that result desired anyway. Okay, so that's it for that one. And uh, yeah, we've got more lessons coming up also. Okay, so make sure to check out the links uh, below this video if you are on YouTube uh, to make sure that you're in our group because uh, you want to be in our group where you know there's a lot more magic that's going to be happening, okay? So with that, uh, I would love for you to come back and share your results, listen to the visualization, what, what came out for you through that, what were you feeling, uh, absolutely come back and comment and let us know uh, what you've got out of this lesson and also, you know, the results that you have received for yourself. We absolutely want to hear from you. And with that, I will say goodbye and I will see you on the next lesson and also see you in our group.